Fractions built around one. Fractions are numbers that describe a relationship between a part and a whole. Let's explore fractions that involve the number one in the numerator or denominator and the fractions that can be simplified because they really just mean one. One is the identity number for multiplication and division. One times any number is that same number and any number divided by one is that same number. Fractions can represent division. We start with the whole. We're looking for a part. When we're writing it as fractions, the whole is in the numerator. The part in the denominator tells us how many are in each group. The simplified answer is how many groups we have. 3 divided by 1 is 3. We can also say 3 over 1 and it simplifies to just plain 3. If we divide a number by itself, we make the number in each group the same as the whole number we started with. We're going to have one group. 3 divided by 3 is 1. 3 over 3 is 1. Another example. 9 divided by 1 is 9. There are 9 groups of 1 if I have 9 socks. 9 divided by 9 is 1. If I have 9 socks in each group, I will have one whole group. It can be a big number too. 100 divided into groups of 1. I'm going to need 100 groups. 100 over 1 is 100. And 100 over 100 is 1. One group of 100. Sometimes it's just a part. If we only have one whole and we split that into three parts, we can't simplify the answer. 1 divided by 3 is 1 third, one piece of a whole, where the whole thing would be three pieces. Order matters. 3 over 1 is 3. It's not the same as 1 third, a piece of a sock. The bigger the number, the more difference it makes. Let's call this green block one whole. One over one is one. Ten over one is ten. It's actually a hundred times as big as one-tenth or zero point one. And this stack of a hundred? Nope, not the same as one one-hundredth. It would be like saying a hundred dollars is the same as one cent. Bringing it all back together, 3 over 1 is 3. Anything over 1 is that thing. 3 over 3 is 1. Anything over the same thing is 1, except it can't be 0. Quiz time. Hit pause if you need to, but these shouldn't take very long at all. That's right. All the answers are 1. Let's mix things up a bit. Put them together. Hit pause. Jot down the answers. Anything divided by itself is 1. Anything divided by 1 is itself. And 25 divided by 5 is 5, because 5 times 5 is 25. Let's do this. The legal stuff. 